Lorraine mentioned that I, I um, major in, in psychology, and so one of the subjects that I really enjoyed is, um, not enjoyed, but I'm interested in is um, schizophrenia. Um, and so the name of this poem is uh, Schism with Reality, um, and it deals with what it's like dealing with schizophrenia. I remember when I caused the 2011 Japanese tsunami. I remember the guilt when I realized what I'd done, the paranoia when I realized it was all my fault. They would find me. They would find me and they would kill me for all the death and damage I had caused. They would find me. I remember when the flowers began to talk to me. I remember the confusion when the morning glories beckoned, telling me I was ugly because my colors weren't as vibrant as theirs. They singled me out for the sickness of my hue. They assured me they knew what I had done, and they would protect me, so long as I kept their secret too. I remember the horror when the flowers revealed to me their winnowing. Their plan to poison the groundwater and clown cleanse humanity. They chose me because of the the my ruthless act of destruction, for my imperfection, my dilapidated state. So long as I abided by their whims, they promised I would be spared the coming doom. I remember the taste of toothpaste. I remember chewing gobs and gobs of it, the conviction that the fluoride within would protect me. So the flowers said. All the while convinced that my secret would be spilled, that a rose would squeal to somebody, that amid the rubble in Japan, someone would find evidence traceable to me. The incessant nags of their scented voices to eat, 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 motivating with reminders of my ugliness. I remember the depression when I forgot how to carry on a conversation. When I realized the knots in my hair had gone unaddressed for months. I remember the smell, the musty smell of my clothing, the same attire worn for a week, or two, or three. I remember the loss of time when I last saw a smile that was not mine. I remember the scorch of daylight as I stepped outside and the look in a stranger's eyes as they passed me by. I remember weeping, knowing no one would be saved but me. The flowers scolded me for my weakness, and I couldn't sleep. I remember the remorse of eating something other than Colgate, the sadness when it tasted the same. I remember the anger the refusal to be the flower's messiah. I remember the dirt beneath my fingernails, knees soaked with topsoil, rending my slanderous saviors from the ground, their calls of discontent persisting, reminding me of the rancid deed, the looming doom in my impotent color. I remember the fear when I heard the sirens approaching, certain my liability had been discovered. I remember the laughter of the dismembered blossoms in my lap, narrating the fate that would befall me. I remember how the neighbors stared at me from their doorstep as I knelt in their tattered flower garden, crying uncontrollably. I remember when I had schizophrenia. Um, I, I, I basically constructed that poem from reading first-hand accounts of actual people who suffered from schizophrenia. Um, and so that was sort of kind of my way of embodying what that would feel like.